Good evening. As you watch this video, Thanksgiving will have passed. We will probably have eaten too much and probably not have been thankful enough, but those are things that we do need to work on. I was in Atlanta a couple of weeks ago with Clarence Plack, and we were at their annual Arthritis Foundation affair, and he and I presented to them a facsimile check. And this was monies that had been collected by you, monies that had been raised by you, the local lodges. Arthritis Foundation is one of the many programs that the local lodges uh, take part in. Now, if your lodge works in this program and you get some good community support and some publicity for your lodge and our order, then that's very good. If you don't use this program, I commend it that it is a good program and we can utilize working with these people because these are other volunteers and the line people that work in the Arthritis Foundation are very dedicated people in what they do. And let's talk about that a moment. Talk about that and the enthusiasm that they have. Now these volunteers are quite a bit like us. This is something that they believe in. This is something that they are serious about and this is something that they work very, very hard about. And as I say to that to you, it comes to my mind that these people display a very positive attitude that more of us need to display. So think about me this a few minutes as I touch a few items. Now we have a very we have some very successful lodges, some big ones, some medium-sized ones that are doing quite well. And there are a couple of threads of thought that run through these successful lodges. For instance, they have active members that want to enjoy each other and the lodge. They not only have that, they have members with an attitude, not only the can-do attitude, but with the will-do attitude. They have members that want to share their lodge and sell their lodge. They want to share the story of Odd Fellowship, and they want to sell the story of Odd Fellowship to everyone in their community. And think with me now as we talk, and think about that one word, sell. One of the major thoughts that I had as I began to speak to the people in the Arthritis Foundation was these people, these volunteers, were excited about being here. They want everyone to buy into the program that they have, and this is their program. Yes, we can. They want to find a cure for arthritis. Now, as I talked, they applauded. I talked and they laughed, and it was a fun time for me because I learned something that I want to share with you. These thoughts will fit right into a lodge that wants to change gears, a lodge that wants to begin doing things, a lodge that wants to begin to be a part of their community, be a lodge that other people want to join into. And how so do they work that? How, is, how do they compare with us? For instance, they want to find a cure for arthritis. You want to find more members. They want more folks involved in their programs, the Jingle Bell Run, this and that. You want more members into your lodge meeting. They want more public awareness. You want the community to know who you are. Now, what I see is one of the major difference between these volunteers and us is three little things, attitude, direction, and dedication. They know where they want to go. They are excited about getting there, and they are very determined to get there. Look at our successful lodges. Those same three qualities are there. The successful lodges, they know where they want to go. Fun meetings, active community projects, or enjoy other members sharing our principles. They're excited about their lodge. They talk about it. They sell it, they sell it daily. But then, most of all, they are determined to get there. They know that they have a wonderful project, Odd Fellowship. They're excited about it, and they are determined to sell it to other people. They want to find other like-minded people that join them and join their lodge and join our programs. I am asking this question to every brother and sister that are watching this. Who did you ask about Odd Fellowship, about your lodge today? Who did you ask in the past week? Who did you ask in the past month? If your answer is no one, I've got another couple of questions. Why didn't you ask somebody? Are you not proud of your lodge? Do you not want new members? Do you not want some new blood? 
oh, some new ideas, some new directions. Brothers and sisters, this is where the success of our lodge comes in. We cannot wait for Fred to bring in another new member. You have got to get outside of the lodge room doors. You have got to talk to the prospects. You have got to sell your lodge. The line of prospective members knocking on the door of your lodge is going to depend on what you're selling and how well you're selling it. If it's upbeat, it's exciting, that's what the new members want to hear. Now I go out of my way to have a good attitude. And I do that in spite of the bad news that I get, the discord that I have to see and hear. I fully intend to overcome all of the grief that I see in our order, and I work just as absolutely hard as I can to sell the positive points. I want to move forward. I want to move well beyond those little points that have uh, that uh, we have failed in uh, our fraternity. Do you realize we have allowed unqualified people to lead us on a downward spiral, and right now, this very minute, we have got to change gears. If we take one thought, one part of our fraternity, see how it fits into what we want to become if we endorse it, if we get excited about it, get into a determined stage, then we can overcome. Now, I'm going to tell you this. Regardless of where your lodge is at, right at the moment, we can overcome. We can dig out of the hole that we have gotten into. Yes, it's going to take you some effort. Yes, it's going to take working together. But I'll tell you this. If you are willing to change some attitudes, to change some directions, change some determinations, then I'll tell you this. If you want it, then yes, we can. And if you are bound and determined, then it's yes, we will.